I love that Walter and Elias. Got some really nice ties. Honey, that Polly one is cute. Yeah, so that one is really sweet. The ties are all the same. This display for the hats is really fun too. This one's cool. The one and only. Oh yeah, that's nice. That one's sweet. It's sage, so we'll have to find a color chart. This is from the 2018 Passport Collection that was released in January. Nice simple striped visor. This one is $19.95. And then they've got belts down here too, which is really interesting. I don't see any indication of it being Disney, um, but it's $34.95 and it just looks like a leather belt. So that's really nice. You just need a belt. Yeah, here's more of them. There's nothing about that that looks Disney to me, but that's cool. You don't always need to have a Disney branded souvenir. There is Jock Lindsay hanger bars glassware available. Also, you'll have to ask a cast member for assistance with that. I really like this polo. I like my husband in polos. It just looks really nice. $44.95. There's a blue one, same thing. Black, same thing, and white, so they definitely offer a variety of colors. Yes? $24.99. Oh, okay. $24.99. Awesome. Got some more polos here. They have it in a beautiful cobalt blue, a salmon, and then kind of like an oatmeal gray color. Another really nice hat choice. Again, um, $24.99. I kind of like the boat style hat. Ooh. That's real cute. And will you put that on your head? Be my model. No, I don't think so because Mickey's on the front. They do have a security tag, yeah, so that's a little annoying. <laughs> Just on top though. <laughs> That's really cute, aside from the security tag hanging on. I don't think you did, no. Um, they also have an advertisement for Chapel Hat, so if you're wanting a more diverse hat selection, you can check out their location. This Nike one is $34.99. Nicely styled mannequin. Look nice. Look nice. They also have the polos hung up. So the exact same shirts that I showed you that were folded down on the front shelf, they also have on a hang, hanging display. And then the very lastly over here, we've got some of the 28 main socks. And you know that it's the 28 main brand because it has that lion logo. So this is Tiki Room. And then they also have what looks to be like Dole Whip. Um, so it's got little pineapples all over it. Those are really sweet. They are different sizes. It looks like there's um, large. The one I just pulled for the Tiki Room is a medium. So you'll have to look at the sizing on the back. But these are $14.99. So great stocking stuffer. Again, a really good souvenir because it travels well. Um, that one's, I think, fun. A fun gift. Moving over here, we have some of the collegiate collection that we've seen at World of Disney before. This is really nice. It's a travel blanket that actually rolls up. This one is not marked, but this is what the blanket looks like when it is un-velcroed and unrolled. We do have the hat, 1971, Magic Kingdom opened, $24.99. We also have these ones are not 28 main brand. They're really thick. These are thick socks. $13.99. Yeah, those are super thick. I really like this hoodie with the patch on the top. That one's $59.99. And doesn't look like there's anything on the back. Got a really cool mug here. I like that it says like Buena Vista, Florida. That's really neat. This one's $15.99. I just don't think mugs anywhere are a bad price. 
as far as souvenirs are concerned. Here is a fan pack, so it comes with a pennant, a sticker, and a button. So that's kind of cool. Definitely a very unique gift. I haven't seen anything like that before. And it's $19.99 for the set of three. And remember, if you're a pass holder, you do get 20% off your purchase. So that really helps when you are shopping for yourself or for souvenirs. That 20% with everything that you buy really adds up. This tank top is $34.99. We also have this one, kind of a varsity style. I mean, all of these are. $34.99. This one's a raglan. It says Walt Disney World, 1971. That one's $39.99. This one's a really cool hat. I like the simple uh, black and white with a touch of red. I feel like that'd be easy to style. It's $24.99. Up here we've got a very nice Turvis coffee tumbler, $19.99. And then I really like that frame. That one's cool. Let's take that down and see how much that is. That's really neat. And this one does not have a sticker on it. So I do not know how much that is. Here is the tote that was displayed um, on that front display, it's $44.99. The patches are really cool. They're, it's very textured. I like that one too. Look at the cool patch on there. That's really neat. That's a very cool shirt. And this one is $34.99. Of course they have the spirit jerseys. Spirit jerseys I believe are unisex. So I think men or women could wear these. I would personally um, think that this would be for my husband more so than myself, but it's definitely all the kind of on your style. They have this kind of acid gray wash and then an acid chambray wash or jean wash. And the spirit jerseys are all $59.99. This one's also a really cool khaki color with that same 1971 pennant on it. This one is, ooh, kept falling down on me, $24.99. And then they have this bright orange shirt. So if you're afraid of losing your husband and you want to spot him easy in the crowd, this is a good one for you. $34.99. Honey, I like this blue one with this cool patch on it. Look. Yeah, I like Isn't that. Isn't that neat? Like alumni Mickey. And I kind of like the neckline, the detailing on the neckline, like the pleating. Look at these. Oh, those I bet are really winter. comfy. Florida winter. Yeah, that's Florida winter wear right there. That's for sure. These are $34.99. Um, and they do have Walt Disney World on the pant leg. And then they do have the matching tank top. That is a cute set. $34.99 for the top as well. This backpack is really neat. So it has the same textured patches as the tote does. So if you're wanting something, you know, just a different style. If it's the same theme, just a different style. So it's nice options. Here is what the back looks like. It's got a mesh, so that I imagine this would be really light on your back, not really scratchy. It is a simulated leather, so for friends that are conscious of that, you do not have to worry. This is $44.99. The only other hat I'm seeing up here is this one. That one's really cool and definitely matches really well with that whole set. You can make a whole outfit. $24.99. This whole set I love. And then they've got this red one. The pennant, the same logoing, the Disney World logo, 1971. And this one is $24.99. So that is the collegiate area there. Working our way to the back corner of the store, we do have yet more hats. This is a fantastic shop to come to if you are looking for a hat. It's $24.99. I love this one, the classic ears. Tom has that one. Put that one on for me. Look, it's got Mickey Mouse signature. It's nice. $24.99. men to have ears. See? There aren't too many men. There's not. Oh, I just cannot even. You're so cute. You're so cute. This one they came out with a while ago. Um, this is their summer collection, so it kind of looks like raffia. 
which is really neat. And this one's $24.99. I think they're all the same price, and I showed you guys that one over there. Let's check out this section. So these are more the graphic tees. I think this is the section that my husband personally would be more gravitated to. They do have a couple tee collection. So this one says Power with Mickey and Couple with Minnie. Here are yet more hats. Mickey Mouse 1928 Sport. It's got a mesh back, so that's really nice for running or athletic wear. If you're sweating, $24.99 also. This one's really cool with the gold embossing, $24.99. Oh wow, even look, it's on the brim. I don't know if you can see how gold that is, that's really cool. Now this one's cool because it's like old style Mickey and it actually has Mickey through the years. Ooh, let's see if I can open this guy. So you can see Mickey from 1928, 1930. 1938 from like Prince and the Pauper. 1940. 41. And then Mickey Mouse. That's really cool. And then they have this cool like, almost that's like a boater hat or something or a swim hat. Wear that out to the beach. Hun, will you put this one on for me? Is this like a like a beach hat? Like you'd wear that to protect your yeah, head at the... Yeah, everything, so... I think this is the front, right? Yeah, I think so. I just don't know how, how you think about that stuff. I mean, you look cute in everything. It's, I just don't know if that's a swim hat. I don't really get. <laughs> and then they have kind of the safari hat, which I've seen in Animal Kingdom lots before. And this one's $44.99. Got some more graphic tees here. Yeah. Let's see. Let's show what mom's looking at here. This one's 37. That's cool. I still haven't been there. We need to go. We actually were talking. We might go there tonight. Oh, okay. And that's an Epcot, right? The Rose and Crown. This one's cool. This one's so light, you guys. You can. Oh gosh, it's so light. I'm dropping it. <laughs> well, what I was gonna say, it's so light. You can see when I hold it by the brim how it's flopping in from the weight of the security tag. That's how light it is. So again, that's a great athletic wear hat. $24.99. This one's really cool too. I mean, I love the nerd Mickey, hipster Mickey. Yeah, I'm gonna say all hats are $24.99. I'm gonna make that safe bet. All of these graphic raglan style tees, um, the all day, every day, and the part-time beast, those are $39.99. Whereas these t-shirt graphic tees, are $34.99, so a couple dollar difference. This one's $27.99. Yeah, so Rose and Crown is in Epcot, isn't it? Yes, it's yeah. in England, and then there's another one too. Okay, so let's take a look at that. Yeah, so these are cool because if you have a favorite, and to me, that's really cool because that's not so, it's not Mickey, so it's not so Disney. You would really have to come here and know what that is. So it's just more subtle. $29.99 for this one. That's really cool. These are fun. And what a fun display too. You can kind of see like the old hat box or travel box. So here's the hanger bar ones mom showed. And then what's this one, mom? Will you open that one for me? Oh, okay. Oh, so that's LeFou's brew. Yeah, that's really cool. That fun. one's neat. This On the bottom, you can see the Gaston's Tavern. That's cool. This is this brand. What is that? The, brand? That's the 28 main brand. You oh, can yeah. tell by the lion. I like this. Feels this material. It doesn't just feel like regular T-shirt. And here's the tag. Fine quality goods for the discerning gentleman. And then it has a little bit of history about 28 in Maine. Um, it says drawn from the coat of arms featured on the iconic Disney Park Castle. The lion reaching towards the star symbolizes Walt Disney's pursuit of his dreams. Oh, that's really cool. That's very cool. I love the LeFou's brew, but Abel doesn't like it, so I can't get him that shirt because he doesn't like the LeFou's brew. Here's more graphic tees. We've got a turkey leg tee. MU. Of course, you have the MU hat. This one's really cool, too, because it looks like to me like a mascot, like a college mascot. Very neat. And then if I, I don't remember if I showed this one. I feel like I have. If not, there you are. Going along with that grumpy top, they have this 
world's infamous grumpy, lean and mean, one and only. So cute. And then they also have some classic attraction tea, so they've got pirates. This is the kind of stuff I like. It just looks really cool. Space Mountain, Haunted Mansion, and Enchanted Tiki Room. So this is kind of an overview of this section. Yeah, these are fun. So we've got some boxers here, Star Wars and Grumpy. They are both $19.95 and they do have very clearly identified the sizing on the top. So you just need to find your correct size. They also have this really fun pair of pajamas that say morning vibes and all of the characters look real cranky. It's really cute. But here are more of the 28 main socks. These are really cool. You've got the Yeti. You've got Mickey in space and the monorail. You've got some hats classic attraction like Jungle Cruise. The hats are really cool. You know what I like about these socks Those are the two I showed you in that basket. Is that the back. There's no pattern here, so it's actually just socks so you wouldn't slip. Right. Um, so that's so nice. the pattern is solely on the front of your foot and up, up your up ankle. Four, yeah. $14.99. People like the Tiki Bird and the Gilbert's. Yeah. I mean, I, and I was saying in the video, these are great stocking stuffers or just souvenirs because they travel well. They're light and small. I love that I don't do matching shirts. Uh, that's real cute. I also really like Talent Has Arrived. And this just makes me think of, oh, are you making yup, 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 for some bacon, yup, 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 the whole scene. <laughs> oh, where they're hey. trying to distract the hyenas. Hey, hey. And they have I love the hey, hey. All of these graphic tees are $24.99, which is pretty normal for graphic tees. No, the human world, it's a mess. I actually saw a woman wearing this shirt at Publix the other day. So again, with the graphic tees, I think they can be unisex. Um, so if I, like, I think this is a shop, as you can see, it's pretty clear in here. There's not a lot of people. I don't think that this one gets really looked at a lot. And I definitely would not overlook any shop in Disney Springs. You can definitely find there's a ton of stuff in here that I've never seen before because I normally don't come in here. So I need to make it a point that when I'm in this area to come in here more. So Stitch is not our favorite, either one of our favorite, but I will say the, this line is so comfortable. It's And the it looks like they have shorts and pants. And the pants and the material is just so soft and nice. The pants are $36.99. I was just trying to show the pattern up close a bit more. Um, Here's an up close of boxers. <laughs> That's <laughs> really cute. I mean, it's cute. Now, these are that one where they're stiff material, but the... Yes, that. and before they were making a lot of pajamas in this material, which is why I never bought Able pajamas prior to some of the ones they purchased for him, because they are kind of stiff and weird. I also like that you've got some old style Mickey. Um... You know, they're just is a little more classic looking. Not so brightly colored. So for your, the gentleman that's just a little more subtle. I think that this is kind of his alley. So here is this section. The only thing I didn't get to show you yet is the patriotic display. So they've got quite a selection of um, patriotic tees. This raglan is $34.99 and it has a Mickey USA pocket and the sleeves have stars. They do have this cool journal, which is actually not traditionally a gift I would get for a man, but that's really cool, $17.99. This is the one the mannequin is wearing. So you got to see it open on a mannequin. And I'm not seeing a tag. I think they're maybe all tucked in. And I feel so badly untucking all of that. I would say though it's the same price. This jacket is really nice as well. It's a thick knit and it has the Mickey and patch. Again, I'm not seeing a tag and I don't want to untuck, but jackets are typically in the $50 range. Here is a cool Americana mug, $15.99, normal price. I showed you that frame on the other side. Here's a little fedora. My husband doesn't typically wear the fedoras, but our good friend Tom might for Dapper Day. Again, I'm not seeing the tag on that either. Sorry about that, you guys. I love this throw. 
I'm all about a good blanket. This is a cool frame too. And heavy. $24.99. Wow, that is a hefty. Wow, I really like this one. Look how cool the metallic print is. That one's a neat shirt. You can kind of see it. Just says Mickey Mouse, American Legend, USA. That one's a cool one. And then they've got some Love Mickey pillows. And then also they are featuring, um, like they feature chapel hats. They're also featuring other man location, you know, man stores. They have the Art of Shaving where you can purchase their shave kit. It says visit D-Tech. So the one at, um, across the way where you can get customized phone cases. And then they also have some Ray-Bans and sunglasses. And I believe there's a sunglass store um, down on West Side by the movie theater and the bowling alley. So that was a pretty good sweep. Of 23 in Maine. 28 in Maine, sorry. Oh, and that right there is a dressing room. So if your man comes in and needs to try something on, he'll be good to go.